Hello and welcome to a new video about my temperature controlling thing here. Yeah. We want to use now, we want to add now our two-point controller. Last time we added the limits and actually a two-point controller is nothing more than two limits. Okay. I will let the two-point controller work with degrees Celsius. I think that's, that's more convenient to use degrees Celsius. Okay, so what to do? Eh? I will add two limits, eh? get limit, start, two point heat. I can, it should not start uh, with a number. Variable don't start with numbers. Eh? So I have to two point heat when to start the heat two point controller two point cool good which value yeah, I need then to have long a long value a uh, uh, control deviation. I don't need a control deviation. Control deviation equals zero. What is this? <laughs> equals zero, I said. Okay. Control deviation. Good. So we will set the control deviation. Every time we read in a new temperature, we set in the color. I will do it anyway. Control deviation. Control deviation. So calculate the control deviation. Uh, so this is uh, process temperature. minus the set point. Let's think a little bit. If the process temperature is higher than the set point, we are positive. We are positive. So we need to cool. Temp set point. That's the control deviation. We have up to now, we have not changed the temperature set point. We'll do this. That's the control deviation. And now, I have to be aware. Status on. Yeah. Here. If bit read. status and its status switch then we are in two point operation and then we need to I will do this here Then we need to check the limits, okay? And the limit, how is this called? Two point heat. Oh, we have to to set this up. Yeah? So two point heat equals new. Ah, somebody's at the door. Okay, it's handled. Get limit params and this thing is heat yeah? and the the address is not process temperature, 
it control deviation. Now look, we will look at the control deviation. And the same thing we will do for cool. Now this time with a different set of parameters. And we'll also have a look at the control deviation. Mm, it's good. It's good. So now we should have the, the limits. And then we only have then to, if we start and switch, if temp. Uh, two point. Two point heat. Dot check limit. Now we should heat. Yeah. We will set the correcting value. To 100%. To the maximum, maximum heat. Yeah. Else, ah, here I also had to get to the pose. That's good. Else, and uh, we will do also this if two point cool. We'll set to minus 100. Now, we should, we should see how it's heating or cooling. And we also need to, to make a new input. Yeah. Uh, so handle key event. If we are If we are in main menu and we press D, yeah. main menu edit input value zero, right? And if we are in main menu edit, here, if we're in manual, we are changing the correcting value. And if we are in status two point or switch, or how was the status called? Status switch. We are not changing the correcting value, we are changing the temp set point. And the temp set point, hmm, we will limit this. We have to limit this. Yeah. Right now, right now I make it hard coded and I will simply, we are not about, I will simply say minus 10 degree and plus 60 degree. Yeah, that's the, that's the maximum, that's the minimum and maximum. Now, so now if we are in switch control, we are changing the temperature set point. Hmm. Are we, are we done? See you upload. Try it. Good. I want to change to switch minus 100 degree. It's, of course, it's cooling, yeah, because we have an actual temperature of 23 and the temperature set point of. So I will set now the temperature set point to 23. It's still cooling. <laughs> If we turn this on, we see, ooh, yeah, it's cooling. Why is that? Yeah? 
let's set the temperature set point to 25. Hmm. Still cooling. This is for sure not correct. This is for sure not correct, right? What to do, what to do, what to do? Yeah. Have a look. What are the parameters? What are the parameters? Temperature scaling. Heat on, minus 5 degree, heat off. Cool on. I think that's so it's five and one always five and one it's the control deviation maybe not properly calculated I will simply do it like that I will simply do it like that uh, I will make a new I'll make a new timeout Calc control. And this I will do right now, I will do it every second. Now that I can do some outputs, calc control. And we will make it like this. If calc control dot timed out calc control dot set now here we're going to calculate now the control deviation and we will put it out serial dot print control deviation Why not use the serial monitor? Control deviation. And we will Do also the calculation here. Let's see. Now we should see the control deviation, what we've got. Uh, here are our serial monitor. We should see the control deviation. Uh, we are switching to switch. Control deviation 23.5. Good. Yeah. Now I set the set point to 25. Control deviation minus 1.5. This is correct. This is correct. Ooh. Why is it cooling? Ah, so. Ah, so. I never turn it off. <laughs> this is nice. Here, else. 
My hand got no hands. Look at that, I never turned it off. I never turned it off. This is good. Probably. Get rid of that. Yeah. Make it faster. Every yeah. Let's make it 10 times per second. We are controlling 10 times per second. Uh, let's see, let's see. This is working now. Switching controller. We are cooling. Yeah? Now I'm setting to 23 degree. Ah, uh, correcting value zero. Good, we turned off. Okay. Okay, I will, I will now change the parameters. I will change the parameters. I will go to heat on will be minus two simply. Yeah? Heat off minus one, cool will be two, and cool off will be one. All right. So actually, if I'm touching this now, we should see at two degree above. So at 25 degree above, we should see that we take this out. It takes a while. That the cooling is turned on. Yes, it's cool. And if I'm now setting the set point to 25 degree. It, the cooling shall, shall already be turned on. And let's set, let's set the set point to 27 degree. Then we should see at below 25, we should see the heating come on. <laughs> yeah! The heating is on. I touch it. Yeah. And at 26, the heating should be turned off. Yes. <laughs> and if I'm going up, still going up, because we heated now too much. Yeah. At 28, 29, we should see cooling come on. If I ever reach 29. Yes, I'm going to reach it. Huh? Why isn't it? Why isn't it cooling? Ah, stupid! Huh? Because we still have these parameters. Here, the heating. Maximum temperature, hey, look at that, on, yeah, we set it again to 60, and off, we set it to 55. Ah, now, <laughs> now it's going, now it's working. All right, all right. We're cooling it, and then if we're dropping below 28, we should see the cool turn off. Now, every minute now, any second now. Duk. Good. Good. Two point control is working. At least, if we do it like that. Huh? At least then the two point control is working. So, actually, 
what will be done next i will use here this thing here my motor controller I, I, we're going to go live we're going to go live with this and see if this is really heating and cooling as it should good idea i don't know but we will find out next video for this time thank you very much for listening Goodbye.